Did you know that Jeff Bezos, the founder of Amazon, was actually born as Jeffrey Preston Jorgensen? The world's wealthiest individual did not always have it all. His journey begins in the city of Albuquerque, New Mexico. Born to a mother and a barely adult biological father, life was never meant to be easy for young Jeffrey. But when he was merely four, his mother remarried a Cuban immigrant named Miguel Bezos. He adopted Jeffrey, giving him universally recognized surname, Bezos. Life started to change for Jeffrey after this point. His vision was grand, his dreams were big, and his ambition was unstoppable. Little little did he know, his life was about to take a monumental turn. And in his words, I knew that if I failed, I wouldn't regret that. But I knew the one thing I might regret is not trying. In 1994, Bezos left his well-paying job and embarked on a cross-country trip to start a business in his garage, a venture we now recognize as Amazon. This period marked the dawn of the internet and Jeff Bezos, a Wall Street executive, perceived a unique opportunity. He dreamt of a new type of store, one that could offer an infinite assortment of books, a feature that brick-and-mortar bookstore could offer. This thought was the inception of what would later evolve the enormous e-commerce platform that Amazon is today. The early days of Amazon were conducted from Bezos's garage with a small crew working relentlessly to launch the enterprise. Amazon's website made its debut in July of 1995 and within a month it had had patrons all 50 states and 45 countries. Amazon was a pioneer, stepping into untouched territory, no previous examples or rules to to abide by. Everything was created from scratch. Despite skepticism from many, Amazon introduced a groundbreaking way of shopping, the and so the journey of Amazon began and the world of retail was never the same. Echoing the spirit of innovation and courage that drove this journey, Bezos once said, if you decide you're going to do only the things you know are going to work, you're going to leave a lot of opportunity on the table. And so the legacy legacy of Amazon and Jeff Bezos continues to inspire us. Amazon's success didn't happen overnight. It was a process that required years of hard work, dedication, and a relentless focus on customer satisfaction. While the early days were challenging, Jeff Bezos and his team remained undeterred, holding their long-term vision close. As the new millennium dawned, so came a new era of innovation for Amazon. The company expanded its product offerings beyond books introducing electronics, toys, and even kitchenware. They set out to create a one-stop shop for online shoppers. Amazon introduced features customer reviews, personalized recommendations, and one-click shopping, all aimed at making online shopping as easy and enjoyable as possible. This perseverance paid off, setting the foundation for Amazon's future growth and setting the precedent of overcoming obstacles. Despite the odds, Amazon emerged stronger, setting the stage for its continued growth. This early success story serves as an inspiration for entrepreneurs and businesses worldwide, reminding us all that challenges are but stepping stones on the path to victory. To cap it off, here's a quote that encapsulates this journey. If you're not stubborn, you'll, you'll give up on experiments too soon. And if you're not flexible, you'll pound your head against the wall and you won't see a different solution to a problem you're trying. Amazon didn't stop at books. Bezos had a vision to create the Everything Store. This vision soon became a reality, as as Amazon diversified its product offerings. Starting as as an online bookstore, the company strategically expanded into various, various sectors. Amazon was no longer just bookstore. It was becoming one-stop shop for entertainment Bezos's forward-thinking approach and his ability to anticipate market trends were instrumental in this expansion. However, this expansion wasn't without challenges. Amazon had to navigate a complex web of regulations, competition and expectations. But with Bezos at the helm, the company managed, managed to overcome these hurdles. And vision steered Amazon through this period of rapid growth. Through these, Amazon transformed from a niche online bookstore into a global marketplace. 
It was no longer about selling books, about providing a wide range of products and services to consumers around the world. And while the journey was not always smooth, Amazon's success story is a testament to the power power of innovation, foresight and relentless pursuit of customer. Amazon was no longer just an online bookstore, it was a global marketplace. We've had, we've had three big ideas at Amazon that we've stuck with for 18 years and they're the reason we're successful, put the customer first, invent and be patient. Bezos once asserted, innovation is the key to success. Amazon has certainly lived up to this maxim. Imagine a possibility where you can purchase a book with just a mouse click or a virtual aid can play your favorite tune without any physical contact with the device. An unreal concept, isn't it? Not anymore, courtesy of Amazon's ingenious frame of mind. The company's audacious gamble on technology has redefined reading, data management, and even our interaction with technology. They have not just produced products, they have instigated a new way of living, a testament to their innovative spirit. Innovation isn't merely about devising new products or services, it's about altering the way we live, work, and think. That's what Amazon has accomplished. The company has consistently strived to make our lives more comfortable, more interconnected, and more thrilling. To put it succinctly, Amazon's persistent innovation has revolutionized the way we shop, read, and even interact with technology. However, the journey of innovation is far from over. As Bezos himself puts it, what we need to do is always lean into the future, when the world changes around you and when it changes against you. What used to be a tailwind is now a headwind. You have to into that and figure out what to do because complaining isn't a strategy. Today, Amazon stands as a trillion dollar company making its presence known in almost every country. Its influence is felt in every sector, quietly shaping how, how we live, work and play. Offering an unparalleled range of products and services, it has become the gold standard for online shopping. Having everything from books to electronics, groceries to fashion, Amazon Web Services, its cloud cloud computing arm, powers a significant portion of the internet. Its on-demand video service, Prime Video competes with major players like Netflix and Disney+. Bezos's ambitious space venture, Blue Origin, sets out to make space travel a reality for every day. Despite criticism over business practices, labor conditions and environmental impact, Amazon continues to innovate, adapt and strive for better. Embodied in the spirit of its founder, Jeff Bezos, Amazon has transformed a garage in Seattle to a global empire. Its journey is a testament to the power of big ideas, relentless determination, and the courage to dream big. As Amazon continues to and grow, its impact on our world is far from over. As Jeff Bezos himself once said, if you do build a great experience, customers tell each other about that. Word of mouth is very powerful. So what can we learn from Jeff Bezos and the remarkable journey of Amazon? First, the lesson of leadership is crystal clear. Bezos's approach was distinctly hands-on, detail-oriented and demanding. His belief in setting high standards and continually raising the bar has a relentless drive for improvement within Amazon's culture. Second, it's about the unyielding customer focus. Bezos has always put the customer at the center of everything, using this obsession to understand customer needs and desires and then building the business around that understanding. This philosophy has guided Amazon's transformation from a bookseller to retail titan and technological innovator. Third, Bezos's emphasis on the power of long-term thinking has been instrumental in Amazon's success. He has consistently made decisions and investments with a long-term perspective, paving the way for Amazon to undertake bold, risky ventures that have ultimately paid off handsomely. Finally, the lesson of embracing failure is a cornerstone of Amazon's innovation. Bezos's acceptance of failure as a necessary part of innovation has crucial in Amazon's ability to disrupt industries and continually reinvent itself. In the words of Bezos, it's always day one. There's always room for innovation and improvement no matter how successful you are. 
And to add to that, Bezos once said, I believe you have to be willing to be misunderstood if you're going to innovate. Jeff Bezos' story is a testament to the power of innovation and risk-taking. From humble beginnings, he built Amazon, a company that transformed from a simple online bookstore into a global e-commerce giant. As we journeyed through the narrative, we saw Amazon's early success the stage for its continued growth. Bezos dared to tread where others did not, expanding Amazon's reach across various sectors and industries. The launch of groundbreaking services like Amazon Prime, Kindle, and AWS didn't just boost Amazon's bottom line, but revolutionized the way we read, shop, and access the internet. His vision of a customer-centric world where convenience and efficiency reign supreme is evident in the vast array of product services Amazon offers today. Reflecting on Amazon today, it's clear how far the company has come under Bezos' leadership. From its roots as an online bookstore to becoming a global powerhouse, Amazon's journey is a testament to Bezos' vision and tenacity. In our penultimate segment, The Lessons from Bezos, we distilled, we distilled the wisdom from this journey. His emphasis on long-term thinking and willingness to embrace failure have been instrumental in shaping Amazon's culture and success. In parting, remember, in the journey of success, there's no finish line. As Bezos would say, it's still day one. Let's keep these lessons in mind as we forge our paths and dare to dream big. Because, after all, every day is, is an opportunity to write a new chapter in our own stories of success. And to end with another insightful quote from Bezos, the common question that gets asked in business is, why? That's a good question. But an equally valid question is, why not? 